friends, now I am telling you about the chromophore concept. It is defined as an isolated covalently bonded group that shows a characteristic absorption in the ultraviolet or visible region. Now, all those compounds which absorb light of wavelength between 400 to 800 millimicron appear colored to the human eye. Originally, chromophore was considered as any system which is responsible for imparting color to the compound. For example, nitro group is a chromophore which imparts yellow color. Similarly, aryl conjugated azo group which provides color to the azo dyes. Some of the important chromophores are ethylenic, acetylenic, carbonyls, acids, esters, nitrile groups, etc. A carbonyl is an important chromophore. Although the absorption of light by an isolated group does not produce any color in the ultraviolet spectroscopy. There are two types of chromophores. Number one, chromophores in which the group contains pi electrons and they undergo pi to pi star transitions. Such chromophores are ethylenes, acetylenes, etc. Number two, chromophores which contain both pi electrons and n non-bonding electrons. Such chromophores undergo two types of transitions, n to pi star and pi to pi stars. Examples of such type of chromophores are carbonyls, nitriles, nitro compound, azo compound.